Hello, my name is Thales and Corting, and in this video I will present KNN algorithm for image classification. KNN stands for K nearest neighbors. I have another video in which I explain this method, and in this video I provide a visual example of KNN to classify a remote sensing image. This is a remote sensing image generated by the Sibers satellite. You can download also this image in my GitHub. And I just created this true color composition. By looking to this image, I provide an example in which I selected nine samples divided in three patterns. The purple pattern, the green pattern and the orange pattern. We can relate the purple pattern to some kind of bare soil. We can relate the green pattern to the urban areas and we can relate the orange pattern to vegetation areas. By looking to this image, we can perceive that we have more than three patterns. Anyway, we will show how the KNN algorithm would work in this image in order to classify it based on these three patterns and the nine samples. First of all, when we have this image, we have to build the feature space. We can notice that as long as the algorithm crosses the input image, it starts to fill the scatter plot. You can perceive also that most of the scatter plot is already created and the complete image is not crossed yet. And now we will spread the three samples per class or the nine samples and we will show them inside the scatter plot. In this place, you can perceive the position of the points in the scatter plot. Even if they are far away in the input image, they are still close to each other in the feature space. Therefore, their closest neighbors will be classified as members to the same pattern. We can see that the green pattern, for example, which has three samples, they are close to each other in the input image, however, in the feature space they are not very close, therefore they classified all that region. We've arrived one parameter called max distance, which is the distance between the neighbors and the input pixels. We stop it in 100. It seems that some pixels were not similar to any of the three patterns or any of the nine samples. So we can still see some pixels unclassified in this result. And this is because we can define in KNN a, what we call a max distance to be considered part of certain clusters. And this is the way how KNN algorithm is used to classify one image. In case we select more samples, we can also classify unlabeled pixels, but we can also modify the structure of the scatter plot, which is shown here in the right. Please visit my GitHub, in which I provide latex equations. I also provide algorithm search codes, including the search code used to create this animation, and also the image that I used here, and the datasets used in the videos I provided there. You can download and use it for free. This is my YouTube channel. Please like and share this video with your peers, and also subscribe to my channel. Thanks for your attention. This is KNN for image classification.